Yo, what's good with y'all, man? It's your boy, Debbie Waller. I'm back again with another reaction. We got three arrested for murder of rapper, Florida rapper, Julio Julio. We finna get right into this. See what's about. Make sure I run the likes up. So we do all that good stuff, man. Without further ado, let's get it. A little more than a month ago, a group of individuals with the goal of premeditated murder traveled from Jacksonville to Tampa to commit a heinous crime in our city. I said at that time that we would make arrests and get justice in this case for all the victims, including the mother of Charles Jones, who traveled from Jacksonville this morning to be present for this announcement. Today, I stand before Tampa Police Major Pat Mesmer, Jacksonville Sheriff T.K. Waters, and Hillsborough State Attorney Susie Lopez to announce the arrest of three people in the deadly shooting of Charles Jones, also known by his stage name of Julio Fulio. In addition, we have warrants and are actively searching for two other individuals in this case. Damn, Today's so announcement would not be possible <laughs> without the outstanding investigative work of our homicide detectives and with the assistance of the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office and the ATF. These individuals took extreme measures to try to cover their actions, but they were no match for our investigators. Isaiah Chance, Elisa Andrews, Sean Gaithright, Davion Murphy and Richard Murphy are all accused of playing a role in Jones's death and are all charged with one count of murder in the first degree premeditated with the discharge of a firearm and one count of conspiracy of murder in the first degree premeditated with the discharge of a firearm. Chance, Andrews, and Gaithright were arrested over the weekend in Jacksonville. Davion Murphy and Richard Murphy are still fugitives of justice, and we are working closely with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office and the U.S. Marshals to apprehend them. On June 23rd, Tampa police officers responded to a shooting on McKinley Drive and located four victims. One person later identified as Charles Jones was pronounced deceased. Jones was in town celebrating his birthday and posted on his social media his locations several times throughout that night. Surveillance video was critical in this investigation as suspects were seen on video following yeah. Jones from location to location. This shows the links that these individuals were willing to go through and achieve that this murder would occur. At 4.15 in the morning, Jones began to head to a hotel on McKinley. One of the suspect vehicles is seen following the victim. However, instead of following them into a parking lot, they stage across the street. At 4.38, three shooters exit a vehicle and walked in the direction of the hotel. They murdered Jones with a handgun and two rifles. This barrage of gunfire also struck three additional victims who miraculously survived this incident. Let's look at this video. This is at the hotel. That and quality you can see the shooters. Oh my God. No wonder y'all got caught, bro. This is at the hotel. And you can see the shooters this shit look are getting fake. in position for their planned out murder. Oh my damn, bro. This is a movie right here, bro. Like the quality of this shit right here. I think I've seen this clip before, though. Yeah, we've seen this clip. And they before. are shooting at Charles now. And you can see that I haven't seen pack. this angle though. What the? F 
and they are shooting at Charles now. And you can see that he's the passenger in that car that's moving and trying to flee. Oh, he was in a passenger seat, bro. Why the whole time people saying he was in a driver's seat? Because like, if you look at the the windshield, like most of the bullets, they were in that that area, like the driver. Uh, I don't know for the angle. Yeah, it was like most of them bullet holes was in that uh, driver's side window. Windshield, what a side of it. And again, they're still shooting at him. Yo. He's the right front passenger in that vehicle. Somebody shoot from in the distance over here too. And again, they're still shooting okay, at yeah. him. Yeah, you could have shot him. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. I, I don't. And. In situations like this, both of y'all just literally trigger after like, oh shit, we finally got him. Doom, 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 doom. He's shooting this way. Bro, dead ass could have hit him. Cause I ain't gonna lie, most of most of these niggas probably ain't got no no aim, bro. Y'all niggas fucking Y'all motherfuckers probably shoot guns in the woods and make sure the bitch work at least. And then Go out and do what y'all gotta do. Y'all ain't going to no shooting ranges and shit like that. To actually practice, get somebody to, with some knowledge of shooting a firearm to teach you and like, okay, look, this is how you hold it properly. This is how you, you know, y'all not going through all that. For the He's most the right part, right passenger in that vehicle. You can go buy the Teslas. <laughs> Yo, they got the they got the footage off the Tesla camera, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. It's clear from that video what they were set out to do and what they had planned to do. The investigation would later reveal that the three armed shooters were Sean Gaithright, Richard Murphy and Davion Murphy. Detectives used footage from the scene, license plate readers, and phone logs to identify two vehicles and link them back to the but suspects. What the girl got to do with it? Because he, he named two people that ain't even got caught yet. He named one of the shooters. So it's five people. Only three was involved with the shooting what the other two had to do, like what the girl had to do with the shit. Furthermore, it was found that the shooters are members of or affiliated with rival gangs of Jones that go by ATK and 1200. Fucking Rico, bro. Jones was part <laughs> of the with, six block right? hey, gang. That is tragic. Detectives believe that the ATK and the 1200 work together to target Jones as part of an ongoing feud in Jacksonville. I want to send a clear message to anyone that the city of Tampa is not where you want to come to settle a dispute. You will be charged, you will be arrested, and you will be prosecuted to the fullest extent possible. Furthermore, if you're a gang member, there's no alleged immunity through a cone of silence, as our detectives will find evidence needed to make an arrest and hold everyone accountable just as we did in this case. I'm about to say, cause I got five people with three, it was three shooters. So somebody was a driver. Maybe the girl. And they said it was two vehicles involved, right? So maybe it was the, them two, they were the drivers of the vehicles. Then you will be prosecuted by our tenacious state attorney, Susie Lopez. Today would not be possible without the assistance of our law enforcement partners in Jacksonville who collaborated with us Bruh, and I, shared in I want to see the see look I'm not finna react to this whole thing but I seen a video where they got body cam footage of them of arresting arresting them I got I got to find that real quick I got to find the body cam footage
Driver! Right, we got the body cam footage now. Open the car door! Let me see your hands! Step on out! Step on out! Look away! Back up to the sound of my voice! Yep. Stop right there. Lift your shirt up. Turn. Do a 360. What? Keep just listen to us. We'll talk about it. Keep going. Keep going. Turn, turn. Now walk back to the sound of my voice. Come on. Keep coming. 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 Walk back to me. Can't find back. Crazy that nigga's not trying to lay low or nothing, y'all. Crash outs to the full extent. In the rain, but got that. Crazy. Go out to the front door with nothing in your hands. We are not going away. Hands up! You get come on out, hands up, come put on, your hands, hands up. up. Target? City officer. Can't tell. Target? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah. Yep. Put your hands up! Put your, put your hands, hands in the air! Hands up! Hands in the air! Hands in the air! Alright, slowly walk toward me! Let's go! Right here, right here! Walk right here, let's go! Yeah. Sometimes move it back. Hey, get your hands up and walk out towards me. Hey! What's killing me is that is a nice house right there, bro. What? Right. <laughs> I'm not gonna say he got a good household, but I'm gonna say that uh, that house is decent, bro. Like, don't look like he in the trenches and struggling or nothing like that, you know. Where most of the the crime does happen in low poverty areas, that don't look like a low poverty area. The grass nice and cut. It's a decent house right here. It looked like they got like some type of alarm system on their house, based off of this right here. Like I don't know, just a poor choice you made, bro. Over here, Come this way. over here, you're gonna get hit with the last people. Get your hands up and walk towards me. Hands up and walk toward me. Hands up and walk toward me. Yeah. Keep coming. 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 Keep, keep coming. Stop. Stop. Turn around. Keep your hands up. Turn around. Hands up. Keep your hands up. Hands up. Don't reach for your waist. Do not reach for your way. Look at me, back up to me. Back up. not listening to heat. This motherfucker trying to get popped, bro. Back up. Back up. Back up. All right, go to your knees. Get your hands behind your back. Stay there. Stay there. Don't move. Isaiah? Isaiah? No, she was in the house with me. Who was the other, other girl that was with Buddy? Around. Put your hands behind your back. She ain't got no shoes on. Everybody she gonna snitch. Oh. 
Jesus. I can see that all in your face, bro. You gonna tell like a motherfucker she gonna be singing. <laughs> this is over with all them niggas when they get caught. She finna drop her name at all, bro. version of Mars Morales right now, bro. Y'all just got drenched with rain and walked into.